Got a maintenance call for a uh, water heater that's off, so tenant it has no hot water. Um, here in the status, there should be a little light that turns on and that blinks. Of course, it's not on. It's pretty interesting because this is a gas water heater and there's no electricity to it, but yet there's a light. There's no batteries powering it. There's nothing else powering it, but the heat, which is pretty interesting. Now, first of all, I'm trying to do this with one hand. See in there, and uh, well, you can't really see anything, but obviously the pilot is off because when the pilot's on, that'll have this light blinking here. So we're going to set it. I had already set it to off, but we'll set it to pilot. Depress that button for a little bit. Turn that pilot on. I don't know if that button actually triggers a spark. And when I push the pilot light, that little bit of gas flows through the through the system. And with the spark that, that creates from that button, that should turn it on. I think I should wait about a minute, I think. I didn't read it. I should have read it before, but it's... What happens inside there, there's a what they call a thermocoupler. The thermocoupler is something that... It's actually two metals, two alloys, two different alloys. And with the heat of the pilot... Just that little bit of heat from that pilot light, that will actually send a signal into the system to open the gas when it needs to open up. So if for some reason your pilot light goes off, the thermocoupler does read reads um it gets cold and it starts producing that energy. And that actual electrical current is what's gonna open a gas valve inside this system to um to power your your water heater without it when that thing is when the pilot light goes off no gas goes through your system anymore so that way that makes it pretty safe now I should turn back on right back on let's hear it and maybe not i try it again i didn't really look in there because i'm trying to hold the phone okay i can see it now see that pilot light the pilot the flame well that means the thermocoupler is going to warm up once that thermocoupler warms up and then we're going to have some electrical current going into the system here at the, to the thermostat and and only then will the gas open the gas line will not open there'll be no gas going to it other than this button where I'm pushing the pilot, of course, a little bit of gas goes in for for the pilot. Um, other than that, it's just a protection it has. But this is just how you turn on a water heater. So the thermocoupler needs to warm up. Once the thermocoupler warms up, it's producing this current. If you can see the status light here, now it's blinking green. So that means there's actually electricity being produced by the heat. Um, I'm just going to let it heat up a little bit. That's it. Did you hear it turn on? Of course, the burner's running now. And here in your status bar, it's blinking. We're not. We're just gonna put it somewhere in the middle, which is where you you don't want to have it too hot or too cold. I think right there is probably the setting we should be at. And that should be it. Um, that's how you turn on a water heater. That's it went off. There's a few certain reasons why these things can sometimes go off. Um, but they're pretty simple to turn on. If it's more complicated than that, or you, you turned on the pilot and the gas never kicked in, then most likely it's going to be your thermocoupler, which is a pretty easy change to swap. But that's a whole different story. Thank you.